Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I've just got a couple of items which I recently bought myself these past two weeks which I thought I would show you. The first one is this fantastic beast and where to find them Harry Potter book. I know it's been out for a while um, but I never bought it myself. I've got some of the other um, collections from the Fantastic Beast one but I found this one yesterday at the local school fair and it was only 50p and it's in really good condition so yes I thought I would grab myself that um, for 50p it's a really good price and add it to my collection. Um, I picked up this um, potions t-shirt from Marks and Spencers. If you've watched my latest um, Instagram reel, I showed this off. This was actually in the children's section, um, but I actually fit in the uh, children's size because they're actually really generous. This was £11, so I normally wear between a size 10 and 12 in t-shirts because I like them baggy and the um 13 what was it 13 14 yeah the 13 14 fits me they do go another size up 15 to 16 but they didn't have that in the store but I tried this one on and it was a perfect fit which is great so I love potions and I'm really happy because normally the potions t-shirts are like dark colours dark grey blue black but this one's purple so I thought this was great um Coming into summer, it's a lighter colour and it says the subtle and as that art of potions at Hogwarts. And yeah, it's really cool. And because it was in the um, kids section, it doesn't have any tax on. So £11 for a t-shirt is really good. So this item I picked up on Vinted. It is from the Black Milk Hogwarts Quidditch collection that they did. Um, I already have the... Gryffindor, the Slytherin and also a Snape jersey in this. Um, you don't often see the Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw ones um, go on sale. So when I saw this one, I thought, yes, I'll get myself this because it's super awesome. You've got Hufflepuff, you've got Quidditch. You've also got the Quidditch one there. And I think this one says Hufflepuff. Yep. So it's the Seeker jersey. And then on the back it says Diggory, because of course Cedric was the Huff 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 Seeker. So I managed to get this one off Vinted for £21, which is great, because um, I'm sure Black Milk was selling them for like $100 when they first came out, but that was many years ago. So yes, I can't, I'm glad I managed to get this in my collection, and now I just need to hold out for a Ravenclaw one. And then I'll have the entire set. Another, um, well, it wasn't a bargain, but it was, um, score off Vinted is this cast member exclusive Disney spirit jersey. And as you can probably tell, it's the Fantasia one. So I know this one normally sells for um, quite a bit with it being a cast member exclusive, but I managed to get it for 80 on Vinted, which is still quite high for a spirit jersey, but I've seen some people selling them for like $250. So um, yeah, it's brand new with tags. And here is the back. It's amazing. You've got Mickey in his magician outfit and then you've got gold stars which are embossed on all the way up and it says Disney Fantasia. So yes, I can't wear this to go to Walt Disney World in September and fingers crossed um, the Fantasmic show will be back up and running so I can wear this to it. So yes, a really good find off Vinted. The last item I bought myself is from Asda, and this is part of the Disney 100 collection. Uh, this was £14. I saw this on someone's Instagram and actually just thought it was a t-shirt, and I love the all-over print, and I thought this would be great for Florida because it's not dark colours, it's light colours. Although I try and stay away from white because of my eczema, um, it's colourful enough. Um, for me which is great um, but then I got to Asda and I found out it's actually PJs um, <laughs> so a bit disappointed that it's PJs but I've decided that no one in Florida will probably know that it's not a t-shirt so I got it anyway and I'm just gonna wear it in Florida uh, because why not it looks super cute I love the print and it'll be great just with a pair of shorts for like a um, down day um, not dressing up or Disney bounding. 
So yeah, at £14 I really like the print. Um, I did see online that they have um, kind of like kids and a gent version as well, but this was the only one that I saw in my Asda. But it's super cute. So this was my haul for the last two weeks, just five items. Um, but yeah, they're all super cute. I definitely couldn't pass up on this spirit jersey because I have seen it sell for a lot more and I have been wanting it. Um, I also really like collecting the black milk jerseys, so I had to get the Hufflepuff one because you don't normally see it uh, being sold secondhand. The Disney all over print, although it's PJs, I still absolutely loved it, so I definitely had to buy myself that. The potions t-shirt, I'm mad about potions, obviously, because it's Severus Snape, so yes, had to get that, and I love the fact that it's finally in a brighter colour. And then for 50p, you can't really complain for a Harry Potter book. Um, so yes, this was everything I bought myself the past two weeks. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this haul. I know it was short. I know that my last ones have been quite short, but I've just not really been going anywhere that's been Disney or Harry Potter related. In a couple of weeks, though, in June, I am going to the Warner Brothers Studio Tour. So I'll vlog whilst I'm there and then I'll be able to put that up so that you can see all the new things they put in because there is a new... Um, event going on called Back to Hogwarts I think it's called um, so they've put all, out all new props and merchandise so I can't wait to show you um, what's new at the one of the studio tour but thank you very much for watching please like comment and subscribe to my youtube channel I do lots of Harry Potter and Disney related content I'll also link my instagrams down below I have one for Disney and one for Harry Potter but thank you very much for watching and I hope you're having a great week bye